Good evening and welcome to our back to annual spring concert this evening. The band on the stage before you is our beginning band. These students started playing their instruments back in August when we first started school. Have to admit, I never thought we'd be here when we started. I was sure that we weren't going to make it with all the COVID stuff to still be able to have band and, and do this, but I was pleasantly surprised. You're going to be hearing five pieces from, this, from them this, this evening as listed in your program. And we're happy to have you here and hope you enjoy the beginning band. This is March Across the Sea.
selection and try the overture was written by the composer Michael Story. And it was written for a second year band to perform at a clinic for band directors. And I'm very proud of the way this group has been able to come along and play at the level that they're performing at right now. This is a little bit more advanced than most beginning bands are performing. Uh, the only thing is, for us to keep performing and keep growing at the level that we're going, we have to take this seriously. And if you would notice, as our symphonic band walked in, how neat and nicely dressed they were. And the only recommendations that I request that I made of this group was black pants, black shoes, and a blue, white, or black shirt. Uh, if we dress professionally, we act professionally. If we don't take it serious enough to care, then it shows in the performance, and you'll see our band program start doing this. I have high expectations for the students. I will not bend my expectations. So I really hope that you will really support us in encouraging these students to look their very best when they're on stage. Because when they look good, they sound good. So we're going to continue with Entrada.
beginning dance portion of this evening's concert with another march. Uh, they are expected to stay for the remainder of the concert, which will only be about another 25, 30 minutes. But it's just as important for them to learn how to listen and how to be an audience as it is to learn to play an instrument. Because they'll be an audience way longer than most of them will be players. And it's to learn to enjoy music and to, to know how to act and how to behave in a concert setting is something that everyone needs to learn. So that's part of their grade this evening. Uh, as soon as they're finished with this, we'll bring our symphonic band up. And they have about five pieces to play for you and we'll be done for the evening. So this is Nottingham March.
Thank you. Our next selection is from the Disney movie Coco. It's called Remember Me.
and that, that's a lot of fun. Uh, we'll change the pace a little bit. A, a band concert is just not a band concert without a good march. So this is a traditional march, March to Castle Rock. This is a piece our students played back in March when we did our recording for our MPA for this year. Uh, we pulled it back out last week and added it back to the program just because we needed a march. So this is March to Castle Rock.
before I have them play their final selection this evening, which is a pretty big selection, uh, I'm going to have each row stand so you can find your students. Please feel free to take photos now. If you blind them, they'll be able to see you again in a couple of minutes. So, uh, first row, stand up. these masks, much as we've had to deal with them. So I'm really proud of how well they've done this and worn them without me having to hassle them too much. Second row, stand up. composer John Williams. John Williams wrote a lot of music that's been used in some of the most, one of the biggest blockbuster movies that have been written, written in the last 30, 40 years. Uh, in this, we have music from Raiders of the Lost Ark, from Midway, from Star Wars, and from the 1986 Olympics in Los Angeles. So this is The Marches of John Williams.
workout. Uh, tonight, bittersweet moment. Uh, a lot of eighth graders up here that won't be back anymore after tonight. Be moving on to join the Fernie Beach High School Band, which we're going to give you a preview of in just a moment. But would our, all of our eighth graders please stand? All eighth graders. So, quick, let's back down. This leaves a lot of big holes to fill from our beginning band for this group for next year. These students started in sixth, some of them in seventh grade, and have progressed to this level in just basically a year and a half because we lost part of last year and a good bit of this year as, as well. So we're gonna bring in, in just a moment, uh, the Fernie Beach High School Mighty Marching Pirates and their, their new members to, to join them to give you an introduction of what you'll be hearing at the football games in the fall.
having the flow to be able to do this. Uh, so I'm so excited this is Jeremy has us to do this. And that we have the added bonus of throwing in some acres. <laughs>